parents are transmitted to the offsprings grigor mendel described those which are responsible for the inheritance of characters as factors the real structure and peculiarities of these factors were not identified till the early 20th century it was through further studies that the significance of dna deoxyribonucleic acid molecule in the inheritance of characters was made clear it was also found that the carriers of heredity which mendel described as factors were the genes present in dna findings about the structure of dna in chromosomes became a great achievement in the later genetic researches molecular genetics is a fast developing area in the field of scientific research two scientists james watson and francis crick presented the double helical model of dna in 1953 this model fetched wide acceptance in the scientific world and they were awarded the nobel prize in 1962 mendel presented the most scientific inferences about the inheritance of characters but at that time the scientific world discarded his inferences scientists named karl korens erik von schermack and hugo de vries conducted similar experiments and observations independently before publishing the results of their studies they noticed the experiments and inferences of grigor mendel then they published their study result to substantiate scientifically the inferences of grigor mendel thus in 1990 the inferences of mendel were established as mendel's law of inheritance as per the double helical model dna molecule contains two strands a structure with two long strands made up of sugar and phosphate and rungs with nitrogen bases was suggested let us have a look at the structure of dna dna molecule is made up of units called nucleotides a nucleotide contains a sugar molecule a phosphate molecule and a nitrogen base dna contain deoxyribose sugar nitrogen bases are molecules that contain nitrogen and an alkaline in nature since dna has four kinds of nitrogen bases namely adenine guanine thymine and cytosine dna has four kinds of nucleotides too nitrogen bases the building components of dna are molecules with great specificity in dna the base adenine pairs only with thymine and guanine pairs only with cytosine now we can discuss how the nucleotides are arranged in a dna molecule we can complete the given illustration as we know about the peculiarities in the pairing of nitrogen bases here the pentagon represents the sugar molecule phosphate molecules are shown as small circles nitrogen bases form the stars each nitrogen base is represented by their first letter so the first pairing is between guanine and cytosine can you say which nitrogen base is represented as t in the second pair yes it is thymine which pairs only with adenine we can complete the illustration by pairing adenine with thymine and guanine with cytosine rna is another nucleic acid like dna rna is also formed of nucleotides ribose sugar is present in rna in rna the nitrogen base uracil is seen instead of thymine majority of rnas have only a single strand Compare the structure of DNA and RNA and complete the table suitably. DNA has two strands. The sugar is deoxyribose. Nitrogen bases are adenine, thymine, guanine, and cytosine. RNA has a single strand. Sugar is ribose. Nitrogen bases are adenine, uracil, guanine, and cytosine. We are now familiar with the fact that genes in the DNA are responsible for the characters of every organism how do these genes act 
the activity of particular proteins or enzymes controls metabolic activities and is responsible for specific characteristics. Genes contain information for protein synthesis. Genes are particular segments of DNA. They are located in the nucleus. DNA does not participate directly in protein synthesis. DNA performs its activities with the help of RNA. RNA that carries information from DNA reaches ribosome and controls protein synthesis. Since this RNA is messenger of DNA, it is called messenger RNA or mRNA. Besides mRNA, there are tRNA or transfer RNA that carry amino acids to the ribosome and rRNA or ribosomal RNA that are seen associated with ribosomes. Protein molecule is synthesized by the combined activity of all these molecules. Let us go through the process of protein synthesis. DNA, mRNA is formed from DNA, mRNA leave the nucleus, mRNA reaches the ribosome, tRNA or transfer RNA transfer different amino acids to the ribosome. Proteins are synthesized using different amino acids based on the information in the messenger RNA. Let us see on the next class. Moon lecture tele revered in the Chodi Trangle, eight to Unkuranjil Sondamakuan, wouldn't then download you. Yen Claps, the learning app.